16 Gamer here, and I didn't think that they would actually do this, but there's a new Imaginary in theater with new enemies. Yeah, so that means that we have to make another Imaginary in theater video. So, um, by the way, uh, the reason why I have it at, uh, five clears is because I was testing the waters with some characters. Now that I could say that I confidently probably built Kanich, like, correctly, as well as, um, some other characters that I was testing, I could probably just do, um, a video with, um, most of them. So, yeah. Well, anyways, um, because, well, I, uh, just only did five, I basically know what to expect at this point. So, yeah, um, hopefully my commentary isn't dull enough. Uh, I hope so. But, um, yeah, I went up to, uh, the fifth one. And, um, another reason why I had to, uh, had to do that is because I was recording, but my fan was on. So you could hear the fan because, well, where I am at, it's literally like triple digit degree, uh, which is really, really bad. So yeah, um, so, uh, well, I don't want the audio to be messed up. So that is why uh, I had to re-record everything, uh, which is, well, where we are right now. So yeah, well, anyways, um, enough about me rambling. It's time to go into Imaginarium Theater. So, um... He, here is the uh, special guests right here. We have Deha, Chevras, uh, Kuching, Fischl, Chiori, and Ningguang. Um, as you see here, most, all my characters are basically fully built. I don't have Chiori, so we're going to be going with the, well, Hoyo versus Chiori. So yeah. Um, also, I did, of course, choose my supporting cast. Um, the supporting cast right here is Chlorand. I don't have Chlorand, so it's basically perfect for me to choose a Chlorand. Um, I was about to take the uh, C6 Raiden, but my Raiden's already fully built, so I don't really need C6 anyway. But um, yeah, I just went for the Chlorand because Chlorand is pretty, pretty good. So yeah. Um, and besides, uh, even though I really want to bring the Raiden, you can only choose one supporting cast member. So yeah. But um, here's what I chose here. I chose the special guest stars. These uh, characters are probably going to be carrying the game for the most part. Um, we also have Navia, Ningguang, Raiden, uh, Arlequino, Hu Tao, Beidou, uh, Bennett, Zhongling, Yaimiko, Yoimiya, Yunjin. You got Dory for the memes. And besides, I use Dory a lot. So yeah. Uh, Shinobu for heals. Uh, Kucho Sara for the secondary Bennett. And we got Toma right here. So yeah, this is going to be my full uh, cast right here. Pretty, pretty nice overall, I would say. So yeah. Well, anyways, without any further ado, uh, well, there's only one thing left to do. It's to challenge this thing. So yeah. So um, this is going to be our opening characters. We got the alternate cast right here for you guys to see. You can take a look at it one last time. All right, let's get this started. So since I already been here before, and I already did like five nodes already of this, um, I can comfortably say that yes, this is going to be a very, very interesting um, uh, imaginary theater because we have Electric Geo, Pyro Geo, and we have uh, Overload. Yeah, this is going to be our main source of uh, well stuff. So um, all right, we can look at our supporting cast right here. It's the main supporting cast right here. So since our only DPS is Electro, we have to bring this. This is our the only buff that we can get. All right. Um, I don't think we need any more. Actually, no, let's do it one more time. This should help. This should basically make it easier for us to just do a lot of stuff. Geo damage, Electro Crystallize. That's going to be mainly what we're going to be doing. So yeah. All right. So... We can just fight the rock boss, I think. This is the thing I fought before, by the way, the lava boss. Uh, yeah, I guess we could do this. Um, we have advantage on Pyro, so we can't just use Chev. Chev, uh... Chev and, um... Deha should do the trick. Alright, so we're gonna be doing this. Yep, this is gonna be our team. Okay. Um, this shouldn't be bad, really. I beat it this before with one star, so yeah, I don't think this is gonna be that bad. And besides, if we want the 10 star clear, we have to do it anyway. Um, or at least we have to at least get the star. Alright. Okay, let's do Deha, Fischl, Chev, and then we can go into Kuching. 
Let's go burst. That should uh, rack up a lot of damage right there. Pretty nice. We can go official. Um, let's do uh, Chev. We can do triple um, elemental skill. There we go. All right, let's go Kaching, and then this should do it because he is the last enemy. So let's do like three charge attacks. There we go. Let's do another elemental skill. There we go. Easy peasy. Okay, I will take that. Um, let's go into um, next. Yeah, let's just do that. Okay, Raiden, Yaimiko, Raiden. Raiden's too good. Um, and besides, we could just um, use her for overload comps if we need to. So yeah. All right, that is it for Act 1. So I'm going to be cutting to Act 2. So I will see you in Act 2. Act 2, baby. So mystery caches are honestly pretty good. Luckily, we got one. So yeah, well, let's just get a uh, mystery cache. So um, looks like we can get one more character will be added to the selectable lineup. Yes, this is pretty, pretty good. Um, Sure. That's free anyway. Um... Electro Companion or buff? We can just take a uh, Electro Companion. Sure. Let's do that. Shh. Oh. We got Chlorand. Chlorand, Kujo, Yai, Miko. Um, this means we have two DPSs on our team. Um, that should give us a lot of diversity. Okay, let's go Chlorand. Okay. Oh, we have an elite enemy too. Um, 90 seconds. It's just these enemies. Okay, that means we're gonna have to go full on Chlorand with Geo characters because we do have the Geo buff on standby. You know what? Let's take this. Okay, we have another mystery cache. We will take that. Free mystery caches are pretty good. Uh, 10 fewer Fantasia flowers. Um, cost 10 more. Events will cost 10 fewer. Well, companion events cost 10 more. Um,. Bless. Okay, we're taking, um... I guess we'll just be taking this, honestly. Um, the more companions, the better, honestly. Alright. Okay, that should be it, really. We can just take this, uh, to maximize the buff. Um, Geo res decrease. We're taking this. There we go. Alright, we maxed it out. So that's pretty good. So now we can go into Elite with literally kind of no issues, I guess. Okay. Alright, let's see how well Chloran does. Um, we're taking Chloran. Uh, Chiori. Ningguang. That leaves the fourth slot free. So, um, I guess we can just pick, uh, Fischl? Fischl or Deha. We only have one Pyro Applicator on our team, though. Um, I guess... I guess Deha? Um, actually, let's go, uh, let's go official. Yeah, let's go official. I think this should be good. All right, let's do this. Let's put up the buff. Let's do that. Okay, now we just let Koran just pop off. All right. And then we go burst. This should do a lot of damage. Yep. Okay. Yep. This should be in the bag right here. Alright. Let's do this. That should give us a lot of bursts. And let's just get our um, elemental skill back. Chiori! Chiori damage! Alright. Now we go Chloran. The Chloran's gonna be doing like a crap ton of damage right here. Now look at that damage. Super, super good. Alright. Let's set up everything again. Let's do that. Let's do uh, Chiori. Let's go elemental skill again. Yep, there we go. Easy peasy. Pretty, pretty cool. Okay, um, we will take that. Arlen Kino Yaimiko. Arlen Kino. Arlen Kino. 100% Arlen Kino. <laughs> okay, so um, yep, that was pretty, pretty nice overall. I will take that. Okay, now um, we just have to go to the next act. So, uh, well, transition right now. All right, here we are. So um, since we do have a lot of overload stuff, we can't just pick this. Free buff, because why not? And we got one more. Um, what's our companions looking at like right now? Okay, we, we can't do like 
Raiden, Arlen Kino, Deha, uh, Chev? Or we can just do Arlen Kino. Yeah, I think I think Arlen Kino, Raiden, Deha, Chev should be good. Yeah, for the most part. Um, we don't need a random companion really. We can just take this buff. All right. Uh, Thunderstrike, dealing Pyro damage. Since Pyro damage is gonna be, for the most part, what we're gonna be doing, I think we should just take this. Yeah. All right. Um, we don't have anything else to do, so I guess we just have nothing to do but just jump in and fight the boss. Okay, this will be the last time you're ever gonna be sh seeing Chev on the team, so we're gonna be doing this. And that should be good to go. For the most part. All right. So, um, well, since this team is gonna probably gonna be massacring this boss, um, well, let's see just how much damage uh, Arlen Kino is able to do right here. Yep. Look at that. Already half its health bar gone. Now we can go into Raiden and then hopefully finish him off. That should take like, like twenty seconds. All right, there we go. Easy peasy. Yep. Around 20 seconds. But that was the fastest clear. Okay. Uh, Bennett. 100% <laughs> Bennett. We have to take the Bennett. All right. We will take that. Okay, so that is, um, that is act three done. All right. Uh, let's move on to the next act. All right. We are back. So, um, it looks like we do have a, a really high pressure thing. That looks really terrifying. I do not want that. Um, this doesn't look very good in our end, so we do have to reshuffle. Yep, we have three attempts, so we can't just reshuffle for something that we want. Okay, we got a... Okay, this is really easy. This is definitely in the bag. We just have to get a random companion. Okay. Venti? Venti, Toma. Uh, we do have to sacrifice, like, one of our characters. Uh, so I guess we can't just pick, uh... Do we just pick Kujo? Or do we pick Venti? I think we should just pick, um... We do have to get rid of, like, all of our useless, uh, characters. So I guess we can just pick, uh... I guess we can just pick Kujo, honestly. Kujo or Yunjin. But a lot of characters on our team use normal attacks. Yeah, we're, we're just gonna pick Kujo. All right, we're taking this. This is going to be way easier than it should be. Um, all we have to do is literally aggro the uh, enemy, and that basically is it. We just win. So, yeah. Okay. Um, now the problem is who choosing who to sacrifice. Okay. Uh, you gotta go. Uh, you gotta go. Um, I, I don't... We can't waste the Bennett. No way. We have to pick Chiori. And then we have to pick uh, someone else, so we pick Kujo. Okay, um, this should be this should be good for the most part. We're just gonna have Ningguang aggro on. Um, yeah, we just gotta have the robots aggro us. So we're just gonna take them over here. Yep, away from us. There we go. All right, now we can actually try to beat them. So let's just do it. All right, there we go. Let's do uh, Chiori. All right, we can go Ningguang. There we go. All right, that should reduce the timer down pretty good. All right, now we aggro again. So let's just uh, have them attack us. Come on over here, buddy. Over here, over here. All right. Okay. All right, he's away now, so now we can just um, do what we want. All right, Chiori, uh, Chiori again, um, Ningguang, and we can go into um, Kuching. All right, let's do burst. That should most likely defeat him right here. Uh, let's go Ningguang again. Okay, yep. All right, we just have to make him aggro towards us. Okay, the missile attacks. The missile attack is unavoidable. We have to make him take that. Alright. Come to me. Okay. Now we go with Kujo again. Alright. Chiori. 
All right, let's do um burst. All right, Ningguang again, and we can go to Kuching. All right, there we go. Okay, do it again. No oh boy. All right. Yep, this is in the back. So all we have to do now is just stall for 20 seconds. Shouldn't be that hard, really. So I guess we'll just wait until uh, the timer stops. All right. Eight more seconds left. Come on. All right, there we go. Okay, yes, that was that was pretty easy, easy star clear. Toma or uh, Yaimiko. Okay, we don't have that much Pyro characters at this point. We, we literally have Electro and Pyro. Um, I think we have to choose Kujo, but Kujo's good though. Okay, I think we have to choose. Yeah, I think we have to choose Yaimiko. Yaimiko! Yaimiko in the bag. Okay. Alright, uh, that is it uh, for that act. So now we move on to the next act. So, uh, well, transition time. Alright, we're back. Okay, so these are our enemies. We got Robot. That We are definitely going to be doing that because that one's easy. Um, but we do have some buffs here that we can take. So uh, let's just take some buffs. There we go. Easy. And we... Oh, we are one off. We are five off. No. Oh, it looks like we can't do that. But at least we can beat the uh, robots. Okay. I think... I think we should be fine here. I hope. Okay. All right. Yeah. Look at our... So look at our cast right here. We are basically dry at this point. Okay. We have to sacrifice one of these... Uh, characters, so I guess we can just do a uh, Clorand. Um, that should do it right there. Okay. Well, take a bite of Clorand. It was nice knowing you, Clorand. Okay. But this should be in the bag now. Alright. There we go. We can go this, and then we can go here. Have Clorand do her thing. Let's do burst. That way we're able to avoid all their hits. Yep, there we go. All right. Let's do this. Let's go uh, Kujo. We can go Yaimiko. We can go into Koran now. And that should be good enough. All right. All right, let's do burst. There we go. Okay. Uh, Bennett again. We have to set up again. Alright, let's do it. There we go. Alright, yep, this is in the bag. Should be, at least. Because all we need is uh, to defeat one more enemy. Okay, let's do it again. Yep. Alright, we just beat it, so now we can just uh, basically chill now. Alright. Let's just do this again. We can get Bennett up. Rand can just do all her damage now. All right, uh, burst. All right, there we go. All right, let's see what else he does. All right, nothing really. Okay, let's go into uh, Bennett. All right, Kujo. Oh, there we go. And we can just set up all the uh, Kitsune. Alright! Yep, that should be good enough. At least, let's try to get at least one more kill. Hopefully. Alright, we got nine kills. Okay, pretty nice. Alright, now we just wait. Alright, there we go. Alright, pretty, pretty easy overall. Uh, let's see what we do get. Yunjin Dori. Okay, um, Dori. <laughs> She's more, um... She's more of like a meme character, and besides, I made her a cheerleader. So yeah. All right. So there is um, there's that really. So now uh, we have to uh, go into uh, well, the boss. I'm pretty sure. So, anyways, uh, let's transition right now. All right. We are at the point now where we actually have to get companions, which is sad, but we actually do have to. 
okay. Yeah, Zhongli. <laughs> uh, we need another one, so let's take uh, Navia. There we go. Okay, um, that should be good enough for the uh, battle, so let's just go in with this team. Um, since Dory does a lot of reaction damage, I'm pretty sure we should be able to just beat this with Navia Zhongli alone. So let's just do that. Um, these are DPSs, so we can't really bring those. So I guess we can just do this. Yeah, I think this should be good enough. Alright. Since we do have Geo and Electro level 4, this should be pretty much simple enough. Alright. Let's do Navia. We can go into the shotgun blast right there. Alright, let's do another shotgun blast. Alright, that didn't crit that time. Hopefully we this one would be a crit. Okay, that's not a crit either, but um, it looks like he is just basically going to die at this point. Because Navia just does so much damage. Alright, let's go Dory. Alright, now it's time for cheerleader Dory to do her thing. Um, let's put up the Katsune again. Uh, put up the shield. And then let's do one more shotgun blast for good measure. And there we go. Okay, that was a pretty easy overall. I will take that. Okay, so um, now we just have four more battles to go through. But it looks like our supporting cast is pretty limited at this point. Um, so yeah, we are basically grasping straws here. So let's just choose Beto. Um, that way we at least have like two more teams that we can work with. So yeah. Well anyways, um, now it's time to transition on to the next act. So I will see you guys there. All right, here we are. So, um, we are definitely not going to choose this. This is going to be dumb if we do choose this because they're shielders. Yeah, that's not going to be fun. So we're going to be choosing the robot one instead. So, uh, with that being said, we need more companions because we are running out dry. We're, we're running out very, very fast. So, um, we are going to be choosing, um, uh, Yoimiya. Yoimiya should be good enough. Uh, yeah. And then we can choose this again. Okay, Venti. Venti, yes, Venti. We need the AoE crowd control. Uh, we are choosing the robot one. Let's just get this started. Uh, we do have a lot. We just have so much buffs at this point that, well, it really doesn't really matter what we bring. So, yeah. Okay. Uh, Yoimiya, definitely. That's number one. Raiden, uh, because we do still have the overload buff. Venti, Dory. That should be good enough to clear this floor. Alright. Alright. AoE crowd control! We go into Dory. There we go. And then Yoimiya popping off right here. Because she's Yoimiya. Yep. Let's do burst so we can um, at least try to apply some pyro. There we go. Okay. Yep. All right. Now we just have to do this one more time. So uh, let's do it one more time. All right. We go into Yoimiya and do normal attacks. Yep. Yep. This was more than enough to beat it. Okay. Yep. We can just chill now. There we go. Okay. That was pretty, pretty quick overall. Okay. Well, let's see what we get next. Sucrose, Zhongling, Zhongling, Zhongling. We need the Zhongling. <laughs> okay. All right, we have three. I think we have three more battles to go through now. So um, next up is going to be a boss. So uh, hopefully we can get some good cards. But uh, I will transition to um, the next act. All right, here we are. Okay, so um, we have a choice. We either get more campaigns or we need the overload thing. We are at the point where we don't need buffs anymore, so let's just choose the companions. We get 25 Rizona flowers back. Yes, that is nice. Okay. Um, yes, Yunjin. Yunjin's gonna be our MVP here. Because look at what we have. We got Yoimiya, Zhongling, and then we got uh, the other Electro character on the bag. Yeah, I think this should be good enough right here. Uh, Yunjin. I think Yunjin should be good. Okay. Uh. Alright. 
This means that- okay, so it looks like we do have to use- um, this is the, um, local legend. Alright, this is the last time right here that you're gonna be saying, uh, well, our girl, Navia, sadly. So we have to put her on the team with a Zhongli. This means that we have to choose two Electro characters on the team. So that means we have to choose... Yep, Raiden. And we have to choose one more character. So, um... Since we are going to be doing a ton of normal attacks anyway, and plus, it, besides, it's just going to be buffing us in general because um, Navia's normals hit pretty hard, we're going to be choosing Yunjin. This is the reason why I chose Yunjin over everyone else. So, yeah. All right. This should be able to take out the shield instantly. Yeah, there we go. Now we can have Navia do her thing. All right, let's do this. We can get some normals in. Yeah, look at how hard our normals hit. They are extremely, extremely good. There we go, 300,000 right there. Pretty nice. Um, we can do it again. There we go, 200,000. Yep, this was in the bag from the get-go. All right, let's do Yunjin. That should be fully charged, so that should give us energy. Yep, there we go. Go into um, Beto. And then I think we should be fine here. So let's do this. Let's do some normals. Yep, there we go. Easy peasy! Alright, now we just have two more battles to go through. Okay. Oh! We get our boy right here. Okay, we're definitely picking him. We got our boy, Kanich. Kanich is definitely going to be our MVP here, but that means that we have to save Raiden for later. So Raiden is not going to be used for this, um, uh, well, this act, unfortunately. But we should be good to go. Well, anyways, we have two more acts to go through, so uh, let's uh, keep up the uh, pace right here, and let's just move on. Oh boy. Okay, so um, looking at it right here, we have a bunch of really tough challenges. We got the Samurais. The Samurais are not going to be fun. So, um, okay, I think we have to use Arlen Kino. That is 100% what we have to do here. Um, we have to- so it's either- we have Arlen Kino, but we don't have a sub DPS to deal with them, so we probably have to roll again. Yeah, that means we get one more Electro Companion. So that means we have a chance to get something. Yep, Chinobu. That should be good enough. That actually should be good enough. Um, we're gonna be choosing the, uh, Overload. Uh, we're taking this one. All right. And then that should be good enough. All right, we got... Oh, we got Hydro Phantasmals. Um, I think Arlen Kino. Arlen Kino should be good enough for this. Um, Law Churls or Hi and Hilly Churls. Ice Shield Hilly Churls. Okay, so it's either the Ice one or this one. Um, okay, if there are Hilly Churls, we're definitely picking this one because we have Venti. Venti is going to be very, very good for this. Since we can't just suck up the enemies. Alright. This should be good. Alright, Arlen Kino. That's a must. Uh, Venti should be a must too. So we are going to bring him. Uh, Venti. Uh, Zhongling. That means we can't save Yunjin for last, huh? Oh, that's pretty interesting. Okay. Uh, Shinobu. I think... I think this is the team. This is it. Uh... We can- yeah, we do- we have to trigger, uh, Overload. We- we have to. So we have to choose this team. Okay. Uh, sadly we can't use Yunjin, but it shouldn't be a problem overall. Alright, Shinobu! Zhongling! Alright, Arlen Kino time! That should give us a lot of, uh, Bond of Life stacks, so that should give us a lot of- yep, yeah, there we go. Alright, now we defeat this, uh, Law Troll again. Yeah, this should be in the bag. Honestly, I don't know what I was worrying about. <laughs> but, uh, I guess because the timer is at, uh, 60 seconds, I guess that's the reason why it's hard. But, um, it looks like it's pretty easy for the most part. I mean, look at this. We're literally, like, destroying everything in our own path. Like, it's, like, super easy. Alright. Let's do, uh, let's do the loop again. This should give us, um, yeah, this should give us... Zhongling. We can go into Arlen Kino again. Um, and then we can just wreak havoc right here. Yep, there we go. We beat it him twice over. And Alright, there we go. Another defeat. 
Uh, let's try to go for the six defeat. All right, let's go into Venti, our boy. And we can go into uh, Arlenkino, get the buff again. We are at full bond of life stacks. Yeah, this is in the bag 100% easily. Look at this. Look at this. This is so easy. Yeah, that's it. There we go. All right, one more boss to go. That means we can use Kanich now! Isn't that wonderful? Um, since we are going to be using Kanich and since he does need burning on our side, um, we already do have our core lineup. We have Kanich, Raiden, um, Bennett, and Zhongling. That should be good enough for the most part. But since we do have to choose a casting member, Elon. Yelon should be good enough. Okay, wait, since we do have a uh, Yelon, we can choose, um... Can't do something else, but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure we should be fine for the most part. Okay. Alright, we got some buffs left, so I guess we can just choose um some stuff. So we're gonna be going random companion. Let's see what we have left so far. Sucrose. Um I don't think we need anything else really. Okay. Uh I guess we could take this for the the lulls, because why not? Okay. Uh, let's just uh, do this. I think I think we should be good enough. We don't even need a lot for the most part. We just have to defeat this thing as fast as we can. We just need Electro for the uh, parts and we're good. So that means this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. This should be it right here. Um, yeah. We can just have Raiden do her thing uh, once the boss uh, decides to just go invisible. Alright, let's do this. Let's set up right here. Let's go Kanich. And let's do his uh, his thing. Yeah, look at the damage! Look at that damage. It's, it's so dumb. Dumb damage. Alright. Now we just go into uh, Raiden. Raiden does a lot of damage on her own. So we can't just go into her. Just in case Kanich doesn't have his stuff up. Yeah, there we go. Now we can go into... Bennett, we can go Zhongling, and we can have Kanich just pop off right here. All right, Kablamo, 156k, 100k. Yep, that's pretty consistent overall, right there. Yeah, Kanich is broken, honestly. But there we go, we got it done. We got it done. So now we can view the uh, accolades. All right, let's see the credits, guys. This is it. This is the Imaginary of Theater run. Um, we got it on 10 stars. Pretty nice. Even though we did choose some of the easier um, floors, um, I just wanted to show that, yes, this can be done. All right, we got Navia here with the most damage at 322,000. By the way, that wasn't with max bullet stacks. With max bullet stacks, it'll probably be even more, um, especially since we do have the level 4 buff. Most opponents defeated. Yes, Arlen Kino. She is a, um... Oh, and most damage taken. Yep, Sara. Sara was taking so much damage on the robots. Like, um... Because when you use your elemental skill, you're basically wide open to attack. Same with her burst. Um, it takes her a second to at least just try to move. The team that completed the fastest. Yep, it's that team. It was against the boss. Yeah, the Hydro Tulpa. Okay. Um... I think they showcase, um, yep, the Cloran. That was the supporting cast. This is how much flowers we used. We used up all our flowers because, um, the buffs and we needed the teams as well. So, yeah. Um, all right. This is our teams right here. So, Act 1, we got a star. Act 2, star. Act 3, star. Act 4, um, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10 right here. All stars right there. Pretty, pretty cool. We got the 10 star clear. Um, which is, uh, pretty, pretty nice. <laughs> 10 minutes and 24 seconds. Okay, pretty great. And... So satisfying to hear that sound. Alright, let's return to lobby. And let's just close off the video right there. Because we just beat Imaginarium Theater, folks. So, yeah. Well, anyways, if you do, guys, enjoy this Imaginarium Theater, and if you want to support the channel, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. It really does mean a lot if you do support the channel. Help, helps you keep uh, making videos. It helps you keep me motivated to pump out more content for you guys. So, again, 
if you do support the channel by liking and subscribing thank you guys so much for all your support without you guys i wouldn't be here so thank you guys so much if you do support the channel and as for the comment section what do you think about this imaginary theater um, do you think it's easy? Do you think it's hard? Uh, what do you think that we actually got two Imagium theaters in a row in one version update? I want to know. Uh, let me know in the comments down below. Also, let me know which um, characters you used in um, Imaginarium Theater and what crazy wacky combinations that you used. Um, I would love to engage with a discussion with you guys. So make sure to leave a comment down below. And as always, thank you guys for watching this Imaginarium Theater video. And I'll see you guys in the next gotcha video.